Hey guys, Constable Chen back with another Madden 16 video. We're here with our next team we're going to rebuild, the Cincinnati Bengals. Uh, they're already a pretty good team. Uh, I'm not sure if there's going to be much rebuilding. Uh, we'll see how far we can get uh, in the two years. Uh, hopefully we could win a Super Bowl. So we will see you in the franchise. Alright guys, here we are at the roster. Let's take a look at the Cincinnati Bengals. Uh, you got the red rifle, Andy Dalton at quarterback. Uh, backup is McCarron. That's a good backup. Uh, the running backs are good. You got the one-two punch with Bernard and Hill. Uh, fullback, who really gives a crap. Uh, obviously, you got A.J. Green, Sanu, and Marvin Jones. That's a good uh, triplets at uh, wide receiver. Tight end, you got 99 overall Tyler Eifert. Uh, you got a good veteran left tackle. 93 overall Our left guards pretty decent uh, definitely need to uh, take a look at the center position uh, good young uh, right guard um, and your right tackles are uh, decent I would say um, the Bengals D line is really good with Dunlap at 97 uh, Michael Johnson 85 and then obviously Geno Atkins 99 overall defensive tackle um, you got the aging AJ Hawk, he's uh, 76 overall left outside. Uh, the Bengals play a 4 3 defense. Uh, Melly Luga's getting up there in age 2. He's uh, 84. And then uh, you got Perfect, uh, who loves stomping on people's hands. He's 24 years old and he's 94 overall. Then you get to the corner position. Uh, you got two uh, veteran corners in Pac uh, Adam Jones and uh, Leon Hall. Free safety, you got Reggie Nelson, the veteran, 86 overall, and then you got two young safeties in Williams and Aloka. At kicker, you got Mike Nugent, 81, and then you got Kevin Huber, 76. So I'm going to try to make some uh, trades and improve this team. I'll uh, pick it up at the first trade. Hey, guys, picking it up at the first trade, I uh, picked up Shaq Barrett, left outside linebacker. He's like 23 years old uh, from Denver. 80 overall, uh, wanted to uh, upgrade the left outside line, linebacker position because uh, AJ Hawks uh, getting up there in age. Uh, was able to acquire him for a sixth round pick. Hey guys, we're picking it up at the second trade of the Bengals franchise. Uh, made a deal with the New York Giants to get Dominic Rogers Camardi. He's 86 overall. Traded uh, my safety Aloka, 82 overall, and a third round pick, so that's a good deal for the team. I pick it up at the third trade of the Bengals franchise. Uh, picked up center uh, John Sullivan. Uh, they had two good centers, so they were uh, able to uh, give us one. He's 85 overall, and we gave up a second round pick for him. Pick it up the next trade. Uh, made a deal with the Denver Broncos for Trevathan, uh, middle linebacker, 83 overall. Want someone to back up uh, Malaluga. Traded uh, a third and two fifth round picks. All right, guys, on our next trade, uh, we went to uh, New England, uh, picked up uh, Pat, Patty Chung from the University of Oregon, safety, 86 overall. We traded uh, Gio Bernard, 85, and a fourth-round pick. Guys, we pick up a quarterback here from the Chiefs, Chase Daniels, uh, gave him a seventh-rounder, thinking about trading McCarron, so we wanted a, a good backup for the Red Rifle. Hey, guys, A.J. McCarron was on the trade block, uh, ended up trading him away for a second-round pick from the Chicago Bears. We pick it up at another trade with the Denver Broncos, Aqib Talib, corner, 87 overall for two second rounders. Alright guys, I made some cuts, signed some free agents, I got my 53 man roster, I'll take you through it before I start simming. Uh, Andy Dalton, I got Chase Daniels and this Keith Wenning are my quarterbacks. At a halfback, we got Jeremy Hill, I signed wife beater Ray Rice and we got Rex Burkhead. Uh, Ryan Hewitt, fullback. Wideouts are basically the same. I picked up uh, Mike Williams from free agency. Uh, Tyler Eifert, uh, that stays the same. I uh, picked up Fred Davis from free agency. Uh, left tackles stay the same. Left guards are the same. I traded for John Sullivan and picked up uh, Brian De La Puente from free agency. Uh, picked up uh, this guy from free agency. I'm not going to even try his name. Uh, right tackle stay the same. Left tackle stay the same. Right end stay the same. Picked up Jeremy Radcliffe from free agency. Traded for Shaq Barrett. Uh, changed PJ Dawson from right outside linebacker to left outside. Uh, traded for Trevathan. Picked up Spikes from free agency. 
that stays the same. <coughs> Traded for Tlaib and Cromartie. Big upgrade in the secondary. Um, bum, bum, bum. Reggie Nelson. Picked up Laurent Landry. Hard-hitting free safety. Uh, traded for Patty Chung. That's about it. Um, Bengals are a really good team. Uh, one thing I found is they really didn't have depth at, at positions um, besides the quarterback, the running back, and the wide receiver, I would say. So one thing I wanted to work on is just getting depth at every position possible. So now I'm going to sim the year. Uh, I'll go to uh, mid-season, and uh, we'll see how we do at mid-season, and uh, we'll take it from there. All right, guys, we're at the halfway point of the season. We're 3-4. and four. Hopefully we have a bigger second half of this season. Uh, we are second in the division behind the Pittsburgh Steelers. Let's check out some stats here. Andy Dalton... Uh, not really that great. Sacked 23 times. That's not good at all. Um, let's see who's letting the sacks in here. My right tackle. Maluga already has 82 tackles. I'm going to check injuries quick and then we'll keep on simming to playoffs. Broken fibula, that hurts. Alright guys, let's uh, sim to the playoffs here. Alright guys, uh, we missed our season goal of making the playoffs. We went 7-9 on the year. Um, really thought the Bengals were a playoff team. I definitely thought I made them better, so I'm not really, really not sure uh, what went wrong. Uh, Dalton, 3,700, 24 touchdowns, 10 picks. He was sacked a lot, though. That's an issue. Hill didn't even have a thousand. Two thousand yard receivers. Marvin Jones led my team with seven touchdowns. Blocking. Twenty-six sacks. My right tackle led up. That is terrible. Maluga led in tackles. Tackles for loss was Geno Atkins. Sacks. Carlos Dumlot with six and a half. Interceptions was Malaluga with five. So, guess we got to go another year with the fucking Bengals here. I'm gonna sim to. I'm gonna sim to the off season. I'm gonna do my re-signing. Uh, I'm gonna do the free agency, and we will pick it up in the recap of the free agency, but right before the draft. All right, guys, here we are. Right before we're about to start up the draft, I'll show you the free agency recap. My signings, I got C.J. Anderson, running back. Mason Crosby, I wanted to change it up at kicker. Junior Gallette, left outside linebacker. He'll be playing defensive line for the Bengals. Uh, Evan Mathis, left guard. Josh Gordon, I might change him to a tight end. Donald Penn, his pass blocking is really good. Uh, Kelvin Beecham. Altron Werner. And Canadian John Ryan. Uh, veteran Mike Wallace at receiver and David Stewart. Um, I picked two uh, two left tackles. Probably going to move one of them to right tackle. The right tackle that let up all the sacks. I just realized his pass blocking was a 66. So I guess I should have checked that out before I started him there. So let's uh, jump right into the draft. All right, guys. Uh, we're at the rookie signings. I only had a first, a fourth, a sixth, and a seventh rounder. I traded uh, a lot of my picks away. I uh, got a 78 wide receiver, 76 running back, 70 center in the 6th round, and a 67 punter. That's going to get cut. So I'm going to do some uh, roster, roster adjustment, um, and then I will see you guys in the preseason. Alright guys, we're picking up here in year, year 2 preseason. Uh, was able to make a trade on the trade block. Traded uh, Dequez Denard, a 24-year-old, 24, 24 76-year-old corner, and a 2nd round pick. For Michael Brockers, an 83 overall defensive tackle. All right, guys, this came down with a big trade. Traded for wide receiver Keenan Allen from San Diego Chargers for two first and Ray Maluga. I wanted to give Andy Dalton as much weapons on offense as possible, and if he doesn't get the job done, then I lost all hope. 
Guys, this is going to be my last trade before I show you my my final roster for the second year with the Bengals. I traded for Ryan Shazier again. I, you know, when in doubt, trade for Shazier. He's a fast middle linebacker. Traded Altron Werner, a third pick, and a fourth pick. All right, guys, so let's take a look at my team in year two before I start simming. My quarterbacks are the same. The running backs, I picked up C.J. Anderson, and I drafted this guy in the fourth round. Fullbacks are the same. Uh, I just traded for Keenan Allen, uh, and that's drafted this guy as well. Tight ends, I uh, changed Josh Gordon from wide receiver to tight end. Uh, picked up uh, Beecham in free agency. Same with Mathis. Uh, centers are the same. Right guards, drafted this guy. Uh, right tackles, uh Picked up Donald Penn from free agency. Same with David Stewart. Left ends are the same. Right ends, Junior Gallet. Picked him up as a left outside, 87 overall, 3-4 pass rusher. Changed him to right end. He's a 99 overall. Defensive tackles, I got uh, Michael Brockers off trade block. Picked up Walker off free agency. Uh, left outsides are the same from last year. Middle linebackers, I uh, just got Ryan Shazier, probably going to start him. Uh, right outside linebackers are the same. Um, excuse me, uh, I think Tremaine Johnson I picked up from free agency, same with Tim Jennings. Uh, my safeties are, free, free safeties are the same, and my strong safeties are the same. Uh, Mason Crosby from free agency, same with John Ryan. All right, guys, I can set my depth chart quick, and then we'll get the simming underway. All right, guys, midway point of the season. We're 7-0, and fucking A. Let's take a look at some stats before I keep on keeping on here. Andy Dalton, 18 touchdowns, 2 picks. 9 sacks only. He's, he's only been sacked 9 times. That makes a huge difference when your quarterback's not getting sacked like that. Jeremy Hill has more rushing yards. He must be... Starting now. Eifert's leading my team in receptions. Um, defense. Danny Trevathan is leading in tackles, so that means Shazir's injured. And I'll check the rest of that stuff later. I'm going to uh, check injuries. See who is banged up. Uh, we got Sanu with a broken ankle, we got Talib with a pulled groin, and Anderson has a foot fracture. None of them are too serious, so I don't have to IR them. I'm going to keep on simming to the playoffs. We made it to the playoffs with year two with the Bengals. Let's take a look at a record. We went 15-1. and one. That's what I'm talking about. That's how you build a team right there. Let's take a look at some stats. I love, love stats. Andy Dalton almost had 4,500 yards. He had 40 touchdowns, 7 interceptions, sacked 24 times. Last year, I think he had 20. He was sacked 24 times just at the halfway point. Um, running the ball was pretty even. Um, Hill had 11 touchdowns. And my rookie even had uh, 224 yards, so everyone got involved there. Uh, receiving, uh, Green had 14 touchdowns, led my team. Um, Keenan Allen led in uh, re reception yards. Take a look at blocking. Big upgrade from last year. Left tackle led up 10 sacks, but that's come to expect. Danny Trevathan, 143 tackles led my team. Tackles for loss with Geno Atkins. Sacks. Junior Gallet, the newcomer, 11 sacks, and Dunlop added 10. Interceptions, perfect, and Dominic Roger Camardi and Patrick Chung were tied for four. Mason Crosby, 27 of 30 for 90% kicking. Good upgrade. And uh, fellow Canadian John Ryan had a 45.1 punt average, which is good. Pac-Man added a kick return for a touchdown. And let's keep on going to the playoffs here. I'm going to be playing in the, the divisional against somebody. The Houston Texans. I'm going to manually upgrade uh, Andy Dalton here just to make sure 
He gets everything I want to get upgraded. Awareness is key. Also, let's do one on deep accuracy. Where does that leave us? 93 overall Andy Dalton. Plus he'll have like a little upgrade boost. We'll take a look at that in a second. I'm just going to uh, auto progress the rest of the guys. And we'll take a look here. Yeah, Dalton has a plus two boost. He's a 95 overall. You know, team's looking pretty good. Take a look at the defensive side of the ball. D-line's really good. My corners are good. Linebackers and safeties are good. So pretty good uh, overall team. Let's sim this game. See if we beat the Houston Texans. And we do. We play the New England Patriots in the conference championship. Going to auto-progress my players again. What uh, little XP helps to upgrade them. Let's keep on simming. See if I play in the Super Bowl. Oh, get home playoff win. Well, that just gave it away. I'm playing in the Super Bowl in year two of the rebuild of the Cincinnati Bengals. Let's do it. Against the 11-5 Seahawks. Against my powerhouse Bengals. Oh, I don't want to play it. What's my team overall, though? A 95. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. I brought in some good good personnel. It's all about depth. That's what I found in Madden. It's all about having uh, guys that can come in and play for injured players. Let's sim the Super Bowl. And I got 15,000 XP. So that means one Super Bowl. Congratula congratulations on Milestone. So that's it. I re rebuilt the Bengals. The Bengals GM is looking at this. These are the players you need to bring in. You could win a Super Bowl in two years. Pretty simple. Anyway, guys, that's going to do it for the Cincinnati Bengals. They are complete. I took them all the way to the house in year two. I appreciate you guys watching. I hope you guys enjoy these videos. I love uh, making them. I love simming uh, some Madden. And uh, we'll see you in the next Madden video.